services, but the Director of Electoral Services, RDEC, is insisting the new voters' registration exercise will go ahead with no impediment expected in its way. He told Roland Walk on the AM show in the absence of a passport or a national ID, newly registered voters can guarantee for even up to a thousand people in communities once they can prove the identity of the people they are guaranteeing for. Now, apart from the pilot exercise we started today, Dr. Kweku also disclosed that all documents, including the Form 1A needed for the registration, have been printed and distributed to various regions already. You will need two guarantors and one witness, so you prepare them. Now, assuming there is a community with only two people, two people with either passport or Ghana card. Well, how it will work is that we identify them early. Then those people will go, if it will be the two of us, we will go and register. And once we get our card, the two of us can guarantee for 10 people. Then that, the, the 10 people that we will guarantee, immediately they also get their cards. The two each, so between like five times 10, 50 people can be guaranteed by those people. When the 50 people also have, they are also gotten their card. 50 divided by 2, 25 times 10, to 250 also goes. So, that, so in a day, to the two people who started, you could have guaranteed 40,000 people. Immediately you get your card, you qualify to guarantee. It's only when you are challenged that you will not be given the card. Dr. Sriwa Kweku said the process is to start the register beginning with the pilots Tuesday and Wednesday is being conducted simultaneously with the printing and deployment of materials to all centers. We are going to demarcate the um, apply paint so that when you come, this place is marked for one person, this place is marked, this place is marked. So when you have not entered, you can stand somewhere and be watching. But if you say that the marking can accommodate 20 people, then we'll cover 20 people. In the next 20, then you come, you position yourselves. So that it will not be that people juggling themselves and tumbling over each other. But before you enter into the demarcated area, we'll use the thermometer gun. Take your temperature. The Minister of Health, to be also in consultation with them, with the team, they decided that they will form health mobile teams. So the one who pick the temperature, and temperature is above 38 degrees Celsius, then we'll call them that. Somebody is here, we don't think he's feeling fine. They will come and also observe you. After they have observed you, they, they will decide that from the, the way things are, they need to take you to the nearby health facility for attention. Or, oh, this one is normal. The person should go through. So once you are clear to go through, then at the entrance of the demarcated area, there will be a veronica bucket with soap and tissue, whatever, or hand sanitizer. Both of them should be there. So at times, somebody will want to go for this or that. Then you wash your hand and the rest. Then you join the queue. When is your type, you go to the table. When you sit at the table, you are supposed to go with your vote, uh, passport or Ghana card. If you don't have any of these, then you go with two guaranteed.